Oh. Our next seasonal event, the Echoes of Eco, is here. So here we have the Vervain trailer where everything's gonna go down. So let's take a look. It's live, it's premiering right now. So I'm quite excited about this. Oh boy, that sun's coming up. Vervain's got a nice cup of cocoa. We saw this teaser yesterday. We saw the trailer, so nothing new here. Oh, look at that. Oh, the seasonals all sleeping there. I love Monculus' his little eye back there. Crit of Mayhem. Vervain? Oh yes, Crit of Reunion right now. Look at the pots for the Water Island ones. No one is left behind here. This is like a Super Smash Brothers moment where everyone's just here. This is amazing. Look at all the critters. The Vane's Mondrake is glowing right now. It's like, this is just the moment we've been waiting for, man. <laughs> this is the perfect way for the Vane to get onto Amber Island. Got some weird sounds going on. I'm curious where this is going to head now. It feels like we're heading somewhere different. Is it like epic glow moment? Oh, red bong thing. Oh, yo. Oh, check it out. Tribal almost. Lots of pots, trees, trees everywhere. Yes. Welcome. Oh, look at this. They're all welcoming them. Oh, that red pong pink. That is my favorite red fire so far. The hair on that is so crazy. Frankenstein hair. Oh, that's so cool. Landing spot for the vein. Oh, no. What's going on? Oh, <laughs> The vein's going thrown off the air. What's going on? Oh no, everyone's monster world chaos. Oh, the burn the rope critter. The poor thing. Wait, Sugarbush Island? No. What? I'm confused right now. <laughs> the vein's on seasonal shanty. You can't kid me around with this. No way. No way. No. You, no. They trolled us. That can't be right. I'm confused. Yeah, what's happening on Amber Island? The vein's on the... Wait, what? This is... The this is just a next level troll. <laughs> oh boy! The vein vessel. What's going on with Sugarbush Island? I don't understand. And a new the vein vessel. We called that. No way. Plank Quinn, rare pong pink. And what's going on with Sugarbush Island? I'm just confused. The fire elementals. They all seemed like they were upset by the the vein not being there. Is the vein not on Amber Island? Are they on Sugarbush Island? I'm confused now. <laughs> Hopefully the game can elaborate on these things. Yes, download the new files. The Vane's on seasonal shanty. So what is going on on Sugarbush Island? I'm so confused. Well, we've got some kind of crucible upgrade for sure because Epic Waddle is here on the loading screen. Wow. Look at the feathers on the trees. It's really unique. I'm obsessed with this. I'm confused what's going on with the Sugarbush Island stuff. That's my main question right now. I'm sure everything will be answered when we booted it up though, right? Best island skin yet though, man. Already, it looks so cool. Because of Vico has begun on Amber Island. What about Sugarbush Island, though? Everyone has been saying the Vane's gonna be on Sugarbush Island, and it's been like, no. What? Oh no! The Vane's on Sugarbush Island as well! <laughs> I never thought we would have an addition to Sugarbush Island. Does the Vane teleport over there? What the? Okay, we're gonna have to get quite a few Vanes ready here. It's the Vane Chaos. I, I need to check it out on Sugarbush Island though first, man. You can't do that to me. I know Echoes of Eco is here. Look at this. I've got my spare Vane ready. I was like, if it needs to be teleported to Amber Island, I'm ready for this thing. Right, we'll place this Vane down and hopefully we can teleport them to Sugarbush Island. Is it how it works? No, it isn't. Okay. Well, I suppose we go on over to Chukubush Island and get them somehow over there. It can't be through breeding, though. There's only so many breeding combinations possible on here. Well, I don't know. All I know is this island hasn't been updated in a while. And I want this Vervain right now. Vervain, its whole deal has always been a diamond gobbler. And we've got to highlight that a little bit. I've got all my plant quint breeding stuff ready. So I can go ahead and buy this thing. And then we'll be fine, I think. So I'm going to get it right now. <laughs> Because it's on Sugarbush Island. I mean, that's just crazy. Right, let's go for them. What a massive surprise. That is just a huge troll. I mean, they've been teasing it's on Amber Island, but Sugarbush Island? <laughs> Okay, the vein. How on earth has this come to be? It's Christian Bush. That Sugarbush Island's whole deal, by the way. It's basically an island in collaboration with uh, Sugarbush's counterpart, Christian Bush. That's why we've never seen any updates to this thing. But here we are, the vein. You show them who's boss, the vein. Show them Sugarbush Island. Finally, an island that hasn't been updated in a while. Just seen something new on it. So excited. The vein. Let's see what you do. Do it with Sugar Vox. Let's hurry up and feed you up a little bit. Oh no, we're going at the start. I can sense it. Oh, I'm getting the vibe, the vein. You go. 
Oh, that's such a fun little sound. I like that a lot. Biggest troll. What an amazing troll moment for the game. Just like Ray Wobbling. Nah, that's amazing. Edited MPG here. So I was just recording the Sugar Bush Island song, Minding My Own Business. And then I saw this and I just had to get on and record this. Because look, the critters are running around Quibble right now. They've added some critters just like there is on Oaks first all along. Look at this. The critter of Air Island is running around. I'm yet to see any more. I don't think there's any more, but I just wanted to point that out because that's... They're gone as one too. Oh, that's so cool. I've always loved that about Octopus that they had the critter there. That's so cool that they've added that. Stuff Ember Island, we've got Critter Reunion now on Shubosh Island. And I love it. I can't. I can't deal. Right, Ember Island. Ember Island finale today, guys. Let's head over there then, shall we? Yeah, I think that's all it does. All right, the thing. Right, Echoes of Eco. Back on track now with the Echoes of Eco and Amber Island finale. We go <laughs> the vein. 57 monsters. Rare Pong Ping, Plant Quint, and the vein. Yeah, that takes up to 57 from 54 now. Oh, wait. We've got to get a skin. Go back, go back. <laughs> I'm too excited. The new Quint looked so weird to me. Definitely a lot different to the other ones that we've been seeing. Not really based on a creature. Look at that skin, though. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> Plant pots everywhere. Yeah, it's not a crit of reunion, but Sugar Bush Island. Now that's way better. Thank you. <laughs> and this design. Oh, this is my favorite one so far, honestly. The sky is really pretty. I like this sky a lot more than the Amber Island sky. The trees are really cool too. Bird pots. This tree at the side, I don't know what it is, but it's just poopy. And I'm obsessed with this one. <laughs> I want this one. Oh, I want a decoration based on that tree. I love it that much. And I don't know why. We got the monster carnivorous plant here with the hands. Oh, that's so cool. So many little trinkets like the sun, the Rubik's cube, very nature based. Pretty much every nature thing here going, oh, and the Mondrake is interacting with the trees. Well, that's nice. That's a good old Mondrake. Love this big tree in the background. That's a nice one too. Does this castle look great? Yes, it does. And it costs diamonds. Well, I need something to do with the relics now, my singing monsters. So I would appreciate if they cost relics now, to be honest. <laughs> but 300 diamonds let's go. It's on offer too. So that's a must do for us now. It doesn't even change. Well, I mean, there's that many amber monsters. I don't think they were really anticipating so many castle upgrades, to be honest. So I don't really blame him on that front. This is his last amber island castle upgrade too. Quite a lot of beds here. 260. Yeah, that's enough now. That's enough. Mind you, though, once we have his epics, I suppose it won't be enough. Nah, it's enough though for now. Nulls. Nulls. Oh. Nald, I like that name. You know, that is my favourite new monster name. Tusky was quite a memorable one. Nald, though. You're gnawing it in. Did it have a nose on it? I can't remember. Right, anyway. The vein. Should we go with you first? Because I'm intrigued by your vessel. It's a different kind of design to what we're used to. We can see the Echoes of Eco sigil on you. But other than that, we've got a whole new design here, which is exactly what we need. Because the vessel's only captivated on Fire Essence because they were made by Cab. So let's take a look. It doesn't really say anything about this one being unique. Right? Oh, this unique vessel contains the essence of one of monsters one of the monsters chosen to inhabit Amber Island. And that might one day be viable with a little help from the spark of life instead of sending them to That's different! New verse at the end, guys! Oh boy, I'm liking this! Oh. This is Narlo gonna do something there. I have a good feeling about that. Zap the monsters, eggs you've bred on your other islands, and that might just be enough to revitalize the vessel's contents and transform it into an egg for use here on Amber Island. Only so many vessels can be taken out of storage at once before they're powered in, however, so don't delay. Yeah, no, still timer here. It's a seasonal, gotta have that timer still, I suppose. A lot less of a timer, though. Not really as much time for the veins, so get on your veins. Always diamond goblin, to be sure. I got that 690. 81 diamonds we're on now. We've got enough though because I've read from a pod quint, so we're saved. <laughs> There's too much content though. Right, let's go ahead and get us monsters. What do you want, Noll? What mind you, I know what you want. You want all your plant elementals. It's the vein what's gonna be a real problem here. Oh, you don't want that much for vein. You're not being too much of a diamond gobbler today. We'll manage to only just get you. So in that regard, the vein, you've outdone yourself there. Yeah, Sugarbush Island getting an update though. That hasn't been updated since 2013, guys. That's insane. 
well, the song anyway. We've had his epics, so yeah, but it hasn't been updated at all other than that. Absolutely insane to see that today. That new verse at the end sounds really cool. I think Noll is going to have to do a bunch there, though. Hopefully, Noll is the one that we've been really wanting in Amber Island. I I'm not really sure, though, because Amber Island monsters, as we know, only seem to do one thing and leave it at that. But it's Noll, it's his final one, and we have the vein, too. So there's a lot of room here for potential. The vein, if you can provide two tracks, then you've done everything you need. All right, so it's been a little bit. It's been about 20 minutes now, and I've managed to breed out all of my monsters. And you know what? The vein hasn't been too much of a diamond gobbler today. Just this one sponge in. We go into your little nudge. There you go, your snudge. <laughs> snudge. Are we going to name it Snudge? That should be its nickname, this one. I'm going to actually do it. I'm going to name it Smudge. Knowles, you're now called Snudge. Just because for some reason, I thought you were called Snudge instead of Knowles. Of course, it's Knowles. It's iconic. Shall we move Tusky to the side here? And drummer Dairy, you've got to come front and center because that final verse sounded well cool. Unfried pancake, down you go. <laughs> snudge, here we are. Who first? The Vane or Snudge? We'll go with you. And I'll come wait a little bit. The Vane's seasonal event. The Vane's time to shine today. My word. I've been overlooking everyone saying the Vane could come to Sugarbush Island. That is literally one of the biggest things that has shocked me ever alongside the Red Wobblins. They keep doing that to us, don't they? recently. Who would have guessed that for real? Vivian, do something on Amber Island. Come on. Just fill out the song a bit more. Oh, Vivian. I'm not looking at Noel. Even though I've seen it, I can't remember it all too well. And I want to be a little bit surprised by it. So I'm going to wait a little bit. Okay, I'm assuming Vivian is probably going to play as soon as I play some down. Because they're probably going to be in the beat pop. So let's have a look. Oh, you don't play there. Well, Vivain, I wasn't expecting that. Let's hope someone does play that. No, it's down to you now. Smudge, your time is coming. Ladu. <laughs> You're related to Uduk now. Are you Vivain? I like it. Yeah, I'm filling out the song more. Honestly, just what I'd expect the vein to do. It's got to have another track though, right? It's not used its vocal part yet, so I'm assuming it will do. I'm quite surprised it's playing in this main verse. In saying that though, you can put any monster anywhere. I'm thankful on Amber Island. <laughs> All right. As old final verse, we're not here either. Are we in the new final verse though, the vein? That did sound a bit more empty, so no, oh, the vein's definitely going there at least. I love this remix at the end. It's quite cool. Yeah, no, is going here if the vein ain't doing anything. No way. The vein only has one track. I mean, if it had one track, sure, but it's not used its vocal part yet, so I find it quite surprising. Okay, so we play there as well. We're at the beginning too, are we with the vein? I love how the vein's arms are like this. She's just like, whatever. I'm a tree. I can deal with this. Keep posing right now, the vein. <laughs> Keep posing the vein. It's the new meme. Get the vein only has one track. Hmm. Weird how it doesn't really do a vocal part, but sure. Whatever the vein. That's pretty cool. I don't expect any more from Ember <laughs> I'm just finding it really cool that the vein does something there. And to fill out that verse more is really cool. Right. Snudge. Let's put you in. There's incubation. As Furcon likes to say. The egg is now incubating. <laughs> Okay, Vivain, let's incubate you. <laughs> Vivain? No, Smudge. Goodness, Smudge, we got your name too wrong today. Nalls. Oh, Vogleis. Yes, finally. Oh, that is something that I have been wanting and I've not really pointed out. Inside of my head, I have been thinking, wow, we've had so many instrumental new quints. So this is going to be really awesome. Yeah, definitely a cave island one I'm sensing with you, though. If you're wondering why I don't have all of these rares and stuff on, it's because it's my Steam account. And my hotel is full up to the max down here. They need to add an upgrade because look at this. It has the same amount of beds. Yet there's all these quints and stuff. Uh, I, they, yeah, they really need to get on tied in that because that would be really cool. You're going to play as soon as I place you down again, aren't you? You're definitely going at the end. Go on, Snudge. you massive. Okay, well, there's one way to do it. Wow. That's the best sound I've heard on Ambrail. I am shocked. What an Aww. amazing way to end. Oh my god, adding a new verse and a really cool part. Wow. Are you going in the beat drop though? That's the question. I don't think it is. That sound is amazing. The beat drop, let's go. These monsters' arms are flapping about everywhere. Vivian, <laughs> no. 
Oh, that's amazing. All right. No, that's an amazing conclusion to Ember Island, honestly. A vocalist. Yes. Let's take a look at then. This is a really weird one. So its lore is going to be as crazy, I think, because it's design. Then depending on how you look at it, Gnolls are both bigger and smaller than any of the other Quint element monsters. I think this is massive. So there's nothing but this being big to me. <laughs> bigger in the sense that each bean is actually comprised of multiple organisms instead of just one. And smaller because the Gnolls themselves are actually quite minuscule. Are they? Some might say they are little more than parasitic vines that attach themselves to a tree and coordinate to hijack the plant's latent major functions. Like a virus? Oh, <laughs> that is a simple matter of working together to animate the tree's trunk and branches to give it a full range of motion. Each knoll operates the opposite side of the tree and synchronously conjoin their tendrils to form mouth through which wind can blow to produce sound. Mercifully, the tree doesn't perceive this transformation is troublesome. That's quite good. I'm happy for that. What an excellent way as well to have Echoes of Eco too with this plant quint. Love it. Being a tree. But then you got your new pal here. Instead of delights and the opportunity to explore the monster world and make music. Another mercy is that the plant top boss's dual intelligences are satisfied to stick to one tree. No need to infect anyone else. Well, that's very satisfying, but but then you better still keep your watch out here. But then your tree is quite nice and it looks quite similar to Gnolls over here. <laughs> so I'm a bit concerned about that. <laughs> we saw Red Pong Ping 2 inside of the trailer. I think I'm going to check them out in my own time. But I will say that design. That looks so cool. I'm going to get them on my mobile account, I think, in my own time. I love the hair. That is my favorite one yet, though. Dragon. You can see that they were dragon inspired with this. Mondrake, we've got to say in mon proper monstrous terms there. Yeah, if you enjoyed my reaction to Doll, though, please do make sure to go and check out this video for now. I'll see you guys later for now. Man, it was that a good update.